Good morning all of you. Am I audible to all of you? Please respond. Audio video clear. Good morning all of you. Yes. So welcome all of you to this uh, lecture on bots trains, bots and streams. It is a continuation of speed distance time chapter. All of you invite your friends, let more people join the session and do subscribe the channel. Once you subscribe the channel, you will be able to interact more in the live chat and in the comments and you will get all the updates also. Yeah, only 60, almost 60 percentage of the people who are attending the class only are subscribing the channel. We were checking the Google, uh, this YouTube analytics, but that is not nice. Everyone who are attending the class, because this is a complete free course covering the entire general aptitude section for gate completely free. So do subscribe the channel and do hit the bell icon so that you will not miss any classes and so that I will also get update that more people are being part of the course and more people are being part of the channel. So all of you take an effort to click the subscribe button so that you can interact in the chat also more uh, effectively. Okay, so this course is equally useful for all gate aspirants. All gate aspirants means there are 29 subjects for which gate exam is conducted. All those subjects, general aptitude section the common A. Pure science ho ya engineering streams ho, Sarah streams ka general aptitude section common hai. So Sarah streams students ko invite kariye, all of you take an effort. And for the new people, this is the bio of me and these are the details of the telegram channel and whatsapp group. In the description of this video, you can get the link of the exclusive telegram channel for gate course where I daily update the free study materials, daily quizzes, free videos, every update also you can get from by being part of it. So and these are the other books I have written and this is currently the bestseller book for general aptitude section for CSER net preparation that also you can follow and this is a complete schedule. Okay, hopefully more people will join in between all of you make sure you have invited your friends. Yeah, uh, this week one or two days uh, I will not be able to take class. Uh, uh, I will update you through this community post and through the telegram channel in case there is any day I am not taking class and in case I am rescheduling that to some other time also. So yeah, last class I am discussed kiya tha, speed distance time ka concepts basically what is speed distance time and what is average speed or unit conversion. A unit conversion a chapter may be important. Hai. So first we are discussing train problems in detail. Bot and stream ka problem itna aya nahi hai. Train se syada questions aya hai. Train problems. So we will focus on train problem first. Train problem when you discuss there are six scenarios that can happen. I will explain each of the scenario uh, in detail. Six scenarios ka alawa bhi scenarios ho sakta hai, But these are the major six scenarios that can happen major four, six situations that can happen. Situations means in train problem the major idea is a train is trying to cross another object. Train is trying to cross another object. Wo object kuch bhi ho sakta hai. Object kuch bhi ho sakta hai matlab. Wo ek stationary object ho sakta hai. Wo ek moving object ho sakta hai. Wo object ka kuch, kuch length ho sakta hai. Wo negligible length bhi ho sakta hai. Or moving object hai toh same direction mein travel kar sakta hai, opposite direction mein travel kar sakta hai, uska negligible length wala case bhi hai, some length wala case bhi hai. These are the six scenarios. So I will take each of the scenarios separately and explain and I have made some slides so that it will be easy to understand also. Look at this question. First scenario is, if the second object, first object already is strain because it is strain problem. Na? So first object is strain, second object, one second there is some problem with the slide. Second object can be a stationary object, na? stationary means not moving object and its negligible length bhi ho sakta hai. Negligible length means here length means length to be crossed. Matlab iska width, 
इसका विथ नेग्लिजिबल लेंथ हो सकता है ना नेग्लिजिबल मीन्स विद द कंसिडरिंग द लॉन्ग ट्रेन दिस विथ इज वेरी लेस सो वी कैन कंसिडर इट अरो लेंथ और सीरो विथ सबको क्लियर है ये प्लीज रेस्पॉन्ड All of you, please respond. This first case, what it is? I will explain there what how you can find the answer. Again, different questions. Some question they will be asking the time taken to cross. Some question it will be asking the speed of the train to do this in this much time. Some question it will be asking the length of the train. I am just fixing it with respect to time. Time is distance by speed, na? So, यहां पे डिस्टेंस और स्पीड क्या क्या है दैट इज वॉट वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड देर इज सम प्रॉब्लम विद द स्लाइड्स प्लीज वेट okay so so the first train train trying to cross the negligible length like a electric post or an electric pole or a telegraph post or a standing man all these examples are valid so train is trying to cross the object means the time taken will be distance by speed the distance to be covered is the length of the train itself now why it is length of train बिकॉज ये क्रॉस करने के लिए ट्रेन उसका ही लेंथ क्रॉस करना पड़ेगा ना ट्रेन का ही लेंथ क्रॉस करना पड़ेगा फॉर एग्जाम्पल ट्रेन का लेंथ 100 मीटर है तो 100 मीटर क्रॉस करना पड़ेगा और स्पीड क्या है सो दिस इज लेंथ ऑफ ट्रेन एंड स्पीड विल बी व्हाट स्पीड ऑफ ट्रेन ओनली ना बिकॉज अ सेकेंड ऑब्जेक्ट इज स्टेशनरी नॉट हैविंग एनी स्पीड सो नॉट हैविंग एनी स्पीड मीन्स स्पीड ऑफ ट्रेन ओनली मैटर्स so speed of train for example if it is 10 meter per second so 100 by 10 10 seconds will be the answer if the question is asking time if the question is asking speed speed is equal to length of train divided by time taken if the question is asking length distance of the train is the length distance equal to time of time taken into speed of the train only because the second object is not moving at all sabko clear hai itna please respond All of you understood this much. All clear. And new students, if you are uh, uh, having subscribe, subscribe it. Then only you can chat in the live chat and in the comments. So this is the first scenario. Situation number one. Second object being stationary and having no length. Stationary means speed is zero. Having no length means no distance or negligible distance. now second scenario second object is stationary but it is having some length look at this i have created examples so that it will be easy to understand a train trying to cross a bridge or train trying to cross a platform dono okay hai train line to cross a bridge tunnel platform all are because वो लेंथ ऑफ द ब्रिज नेग्लिजिबल नहीं है टेलीग्राफ पोस्ट का विड जैसा नेग्लिजिबल नहीं होगा वो आई यू अंडरस्टैंडिंग सो डेफिनेटली इफ यू वांट टू फाइंड टाइम डेफिनेटली वी नीड टू कंसीडर ट्रेन शुड क्रॉस ट्रैवल फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर बट दैट इज नॉट क्रॉसिंग ना आफ्टर दैट ट्रेन शुड ट्रैवल ट्रेन ऑन लेंथ मतलब लेंथ ऑफ ब्रिज भी चाहिए लेंथ ऑफ ट्रेन भी चाहिए दोनों एड करना पड़ेगा ना are you all understanding that length of train plus length of object divided by speed of train no soumya pdf is not available only printed material is available so those of you doubt please respond where you have doubt train a bridge ko cross karna hai to yeah i will make it more interesting think that someone have placed a uh, bomb under this bridge there is a bomb under the, this bridge so the driver of the train got the information about it just after he uh, just um reached this bridge so he cannot stop it so the only way is he have to cross the bridge completely so completely cross the bridge means aisa aaya to wo crossing nahi hai kyunki bomb abhi bhi wo 
ब्रिज के नीचे है एंड ट्रेन का कुछ पार्ट एटलीस्ट और मोस्ट ऑफ द पार्ट ऑफ द ट्रेन इज स्टिल ऑन द ब्रिज सो क्रॉस करना है मतलब कंप्लीट ब्रिज को क्रॉस करना है ना सो टोटल लेंथ ऑफ द ट्रेन टोटल लेंथ ऑफ द ब्रिज को क्रॉस करना है दैट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ क्रॉसिंग आर यू ऑल अंडरस्टैंडिंग दैट प्रॉपरली प्लीज प्लीज रेस्पॉन्ड दैट इज वाई ब्रिज का लेंथ भी कवर करना है ट्रेन ट्रेन का लेंथ भी कवर करना है That means length of train plus length of object will be the distance to be covered. Time is distance by speed, na? So distance to be covered is length of train plus length of object. Speed of train only matters, na? Because the bridge is not moving, the platform is not moving, or the tunnel is not moving. So speed involved is only the speed of the train only. So distance by speed se ho jayega. Are you all understanding? Please respond. so that is the second scenario second scenario is second object is stationary but it is having some length so second object stationary wala do case hum discuss kiya abhi second object move bhi kar sakta hai na what if the second object is moving if the second object is moving thank you amit second object is moving means for example if it is a man think that the man is running or jogging that means our train is also moving the object is also moving but the man is not having a neglig sorry considerable thickness thickness is what we consider as length here na because train don't want to vertically cross the man horizontally cross the man na so horizontal length means the width of the man or how fat the man is but how much fat the man is yeah that may be the doubt of some people if the person is so fat so should you consider length of the person no i mean the width of the person no because train ka perspective mein itna bada train ka perspective mein length of the width of the man kuch bhi ho wo negligible hi hai practically socho ek person ka width maximum 1 meter 1 meter is so fat this much hoga 1 meter hoga to bhi train ka length 100 meter ya 200 meter hai वो पर्सपेक्टिव में वन मीटर या वन मीटर से छोटा एक नंबर इज नेग्लेजिबल ओनली ना दैट इज वाई वी आर सेइंग दिस इज सेकंड ऑब्जेक्ट इज हैविंग नेग्लेजिबल लेंथ ट्रेन क्रॉसिंग रनिंग मैन सो उसका दो सिचुएशन हो सकता है मैन सेम डायरेक्शन में ट्रैवल करना सेम डायरेक्शन में ट्रेन दिस इज द ड्राइवर्स पोजिशन सो ट्रेन मूविंग दिस डायरेक्शन पर्सन ऑल्सो मूविंग रनिंग इन द सेम डायरेक्शन सो दैट इज द फर्स्ट पॉसिबिलिटी फर्स्ट पॉसिबिलिटी इज सेम डायरेक्शन ट्रेवल करना इन दैट केस रिलेटिव स्पीड कॉन्सेप्ट यू नीड टू यूज लास्ट क्लास ऑल्सो स्पीड डिस्टेंस टाइम चैप्टर ऑल्सो वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट रिलेटिव स्पीड कॉन्सेप्ट ब्रीफली रिलेटिव स्पीड टेकन सो टाइम इज इक्वल टू डिस्टेंस डिस्टेंस टू बी कवर्ड इज लेंथ ऑफ ट्रेन लेंथ ऑफ ट्रेन बिकॉज ट्रेन या पर्सन को कंप्लीटली क्रॉस करना है ना जस्ट लाइक टेलीग्राफ पोस्ट train should completely cross it so length of train is the length to be covered and speed will be train ka bhi speed hai ya person ka bhi speed hai na for example train is moving at uh, 30 meter per second and person is moving at 5 meter per second matlab 1 second mein i told you practically understand speed then it is very easy 1 meter for example if 90 meter is the length of the train वन मीटर में थर्टी सेकेंड्स टू मीटर में सिक्सटी सेकेंड्स थ्री मीटर में नाइनटी सेकेंड्स सो इफ द पर्सन वॉज नॉट मूविंग नाइनटी सेकेंड कवर करने के लिए थ्री सेकेंड काफी था थर्टी मीटर पर सेकेंड ट्रेन का स्पीड है तो बट अनफॉर्चुनेटली दिस पर्सन इज ट्राइंग टू अपोज द ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ द ट्रेन ना अपोज द ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ द ट्रेन लिसन वेरी केयरफुली बिकॉज दैट इज अ कंफ्यूजन मेनी पीपल हैव सेम डायरेक्शन है तो सब ट्रैक करना है या एड करना है स्पीड को ऑल कंफ्यूजन यू कैन अवॉइड इफ यू प्रैक्टिकली अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज हैपनिंग देर ट्रेन पर्सन को क्रॉस करना ट्राई कर रहा है बट द पर्सन इज नॉट हेल्पिंग इट पर्सन इज गोइंग अवे फ्रॉम द ट्रेन इफ ही इज मूविंग इन द सेम डायरेक्शन ना सो डोंट थिंक सेम है तो सपोर्टिंग नो सेम है तो अपोज कर रहा है बिकॉज ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ ट्रेन क्या है पर्सन को क्रॉस करना पर्सन क्या कर रहा है ही इज रनिंग अवे फ्रॉम द ट्रेन सो डेफिनेटली दैट इज नेगेटिव स्पीड लाइक नेगेटिव वर्क इट ऑल ना पॉजिटिव स्पीड ऑफ 30 मीटर को 
अपोज कर रहा है नेगेटिव स्पीड माइनस फाइव मीटर पर मीटर से मतलब स्पीड ऑफ ट्रेन माइनस स्पीड ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट होगा रिलेटिव स्पीड टाइम इज इक्वल टू डिस्टेंस बाय स्पीड ना बट हियर देर इज टू स्पीड इन्वॉल्व टू स्पीड इन्वॉल्व मींस वी कैन सब द स्पीड आज दे आर मूविंग इन द सेम डिरेक्शन आर यू ऑल अंडरस्टैंडिंग वी आर डिस्कसिंग द केस when the second object is moving but it is moving in same direction but it have negligible length is that clear all of you please respond all clear or not the so length of train divided by speed of train minus speed of object if it is so in this case if it was 90 meter train crossing the object 90 by 30 30 5 is 90 by 25 will be the answer. Are you all understanding? That is 3.6 seconds, not 3 seconds, 3.6 seconds. If the second object was not moving, it would have been 3 seconds. So, now what will be the next case? If the same person is running in opposite direction, opposite direction, like train A direction may have, like in person A direction may run. Kar hai. Yeah, think that the person is running. I don't have <laughs> uh, what we can say. Uh, movie level animation to, to make the person running otherwise I would have made the person run itself so I am doing it uh, like simple animation itself I hope you are understanding the person is running person is running train is running moving in the opposite direction in that case what will happen time taken will be distance by speed distance is actually length of the train because train should cross the entire length of train only because it is a negligible length only Lekin, a person opposite direction which chal raha. So, person is supporting the train na. Person also is moving in opposite direction by which he is supporting the train to cross the person faster. So, the time will be less. That means speed is more. That is why time will be less. Time is inversely proportional to speed na. As they are moving in opposite direction, relative speed will be sum of speed. Please don't mug up it. Please don't rot learn it. Don't rot learn it like opposite hai to, addition, same hai to, uh, subtraction. Understand the concept behind why it is addition. Because this person is supporting this train. That means this person is giving an additional speed to the train to complete this objective. Relatively, ha, train ko push nahi kar raha hai, But the objective kya hai? Train ya person ko cross karna hai. Uske liye wo person supportive hai. Supportive hai. That is why it is sum of speeds. Yes, yes, biotechy. All clear? Please respond. But as I told, if the question is asking, speed of train, speed of train means speed of train plus speed of object is equal to length of train divided by time taken. That way you can rearrange the equation and answer it. That's all. So now four situations I have discussed. All uh, did you all understood the four situation? When the object is stationary, train is moving and object is having negligible length object is um, not uh, having some length train is but stationary object is moving but having negligible length two cases same direction opposite direction so what will be the next two cases object is also having some length and object is moving and there are two cases possible now same direction may move kar sakta hai opposite direction may move kar sakta hai like this Train is trying to cross another train. This train is moving in this direction. This train is also moving in the same direction. What situation may kya hoga? Dono considerable length hai. So distance to be traveled is length of train plus length of second train. Yaha pe object second train hai to second train. Yaha pe wo kuch or object hai to wo object ka length. Divided by relative speed. Yaha bhi same direction hai to ye train ye train ko cover karne ke liye try kar raha but ye train usko support nahi kar raha this train is running away from the other train that means relatively it is reducing the relative speed na reducing means sub subtracting reducing means subtracting are you understanding that means speed of train minus speed of object if it is in same direction so what will be the next situation train moving Second object is also a train, but it is moving in opposite direction, opposite direction like this. So there it is supportive, na? 
ये ट्रेन को ये ट्रेन को क्रॉस करना है ये ट्रेन पास आ रहा है पास आ रहा है मतलब रिलेटिव स्पीड को इंक्रीज कर रहा है दैट इज अ पॉजिटिव वर्क नॉट ए नेगेटिव वर्क सो नेगेटिव वर्क नहीं है पॉजिटिव वर्क है सो एफिशिएंसी विल बी इंक्रीज्ड ओनली स्पीड इज एफिशिएंसी इफ यू कनेक्ट इट विद द वर्क एंड टाइम चैप्टर थियरी आई डिस्कस्ड सो इट इज पॉजिटिव वर्क ऑफ स्पीड ऑफ ट्रेन प्लस स्पीड ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट वी कैन डू ऑल ऑफ यू आर क्लियर and obviously length of train plus length of second train or whatever be the second object that is moving and having some length all of you understood the six scenarios i have tried my maximum to make the slides also uh, understandable the summary of all six scenarios is listed here please go through it this is the basic theory of train problem basic theory is speed is equal to distance by time equation itself उसका डिफरेंट वेरिएशन आ सकता है और भी वेरिएशन आ सकता है बट दीस आर द सिचुएशन ये सिचुएशन को ट्वीक करके नया सिचुएशन बना सकता है लाइक टू दट द स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट कैन कैन बी डिफरेंट दैट विथ क्वेश्चन आई विल एक्सप्लेन मोर नाउ दीज आइडिया एंड योर बेसिक अंडरस्टैंडिंग अबाउट स्पीड डिस्टेंस टाइम लॉजिकली क्या है दीज टू विल मेक यू डू द क्वेश्चन So try the first question, all of you. This is the first question. I'll give you two minutes to try. I'll start the timer. Yeah, two and a half minutes. All of you try to make it right. Which situation also? you need to identify which among the six situations we discussed is this and then do the question just a minute some setting issue okay, it's okay okay so very simple now most of you got an answer some of you got different answer let's see a train 220 meter long passed a pole in 20 seconds how long it will take to uh, to pass a platform 550 meter long so though situations x ataya na situation 1 and situation 2 we discuss six may say first two situation together is coming are you all realizing it first situation is train is trying to cross a pole electric pole like this we can think wo negligible length hai na 
सो ऑब्वियसली उसके लिए कितना टाइम लगा ट्वेंटी सेकेंड लगा ट्वेंटी सेकेंड लगा मीन ये टू ट्वेंटी मीटर वाला ट्रेन टू ट्वेंटी मीटर ट्रेवल करना है ना फॉर दैट टू हैपन ट्रेन शुड गो फ्रॉम स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हियर ट्रेन शुड स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हियर एंड शुड कवर द एंटायर लेंथ ऑफ द ट्रेन इट सेल्फ मतलब द डिस्टेंस टू बी ट्रेवल्ड इज टू ट्वेंटी एंड द टाइम टेकन इज ट्वेंटी सेकेंड यहां पर स्पीड फाइन करना है फर्स्ट सेंटेंस से हम स्पीड फाइन कर सकता है वो स्पीड सेकेंड सेंटेंस में यूज किया तो आंसर हो जाएगा आर यू ऑल अंडरस्टैंडिंग सो टू ट्वेंटी बाई ट्वेंटी इलेवन मीटर पर सेकेंड इज द स्पीड ऑफ द ट्रेन वी रियलाइज सबको क्लियर है ये इलेवन मीटर पर सेकेंड स्पीड कैसा मिला ट्रेन टू ट्वेंटी मीटर लॉन्ग इज क्रॉसिंग द स्टेशनरी पोल सो टू ट्वेंटी मीटर ट्रेवल किया कितना सेकेंड में ट्वेंटी सेकेंड में प्रैक्टिकली थिंक करो टू ट्वेंटी मीटर इन ट्वेंटी सेकेंड मीन्स हंड्रेड एंड टेन मीटर इन टेन सेकेंड इलेवन मीटर इन वन सेकेंड डायरेक्टली यू कैन से सो इलेवन मीटर पर सेकेंड हो गया ट्रेन का स्पीड हाउ लॉन्ग इट विल टेक टू पास अ प्लेटफॉर्म ये इलेवन मीटर पर सेकेंड स्पीड वाला ट्रेन एक प्लेटफॉर्म को क्रॉस कर रहा है प्लेटफॉर्म का लेंथ 550 है सो so, ये ट्रेन का लेंथ क्या है दैट इज अ क्वेश्चन सॉरी ट्रेन का लेंथ पता है 220 बट लिसन नाउ दैट इट इज अ सेकंड सिचुएशन ना ट्रेन शुड क्रॉस द एंटायर लेंथ ऑफ द प्लेटफॉर्म सो ट्रेन शुड ट्रैवल फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर नॉट टिल हियर आई टोल्ड यू द बॉम्ब एग्जांपल आई टोल्ड यू द बॉम्ब विल एक्सप्लोड एंड दैट देयर विल बी अ एक्सीडेंट ना सो एंटायर ट्रेन लेंथ शुड क्रॉस द एंटायर लेंथ ऑफ द प्लेटफॉर्म That is a mistake. Some of you made. That is why you got a wrong answer. Like this, 550 meter wala platform ko train total length cover karna hai. Yeah. Now this is moving. Is it clear? <laughs> All slides. It is not possible. But some slides, at least the animation, uh, we have added so that it is moving. 220 by 20. How? 220 by 20. 550 by x. Yeah. Uske baad x minus 220 you can do. But x will not be the answer. Itna clear hai? Uske liye train train ka hi length cover kiya na train train ka hi length cover karna hai. That is 220 meter plus 550 total 770 meter to be travelled. 770 meter travel karna hai. Kya speed me? 11 meter per second speed me. So 770 by 11 is the final answer. Sabko clear hai ye? Thank you, Shivani. So 70 seconds is the answer. All clear. So that is an example where both the situations, both the first two situations, ये situation, ये situation दोनों आ रहा है. ये situation से हम speed find किया और वो यहाँ substitute करके answer किया. यहाँ पे मैं time के बारे में discuss किया, लेकिन time के बारे में discuss किया वो theory. स्पीड के बारे में भी यूज कर सकता है इसका क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाई किया तो हो गया डोंट से दैट दैट इज दैट इज अ डिफरेंट थियरी दैट आई शुड टीच यू दैट इज द सेम इट्सल्फ सो सबका क्लियर है ना देन आई विल शो यू गेट एक्साम क्वेश्चंस वेयर वी कैन अप्लाई समटाइम्स डायरेक्टली द आइडिया वी डिस्कस समटाइम्स यू हैव टू थिंक मोर सो ट्राई दिस थैंक यू आस्था ऑल ऑफ यू ट्राई दिस एल गिव द पोल आल्सो गिव द टाइमर आल्सो One second. Okay, the timer is not working. Okay, this is fine now. Okay, try it fast. Two minutes remaining.
okay some of you got an answer so here the train is not trying to cross each other that's a difference between this question and the previous questions and previous situations we discussed that's why i told you just peripheral knowledge or peripheral learning of formula is not enough thank you renu vijaya we will come to that that was not asked asked in gate exam that was asked in csr net exam that we discuss in csr exam course we will discuss first we will focus on gate questions most of these gate questions come in csr also but we will first focus on gate questions itself okay so the time is up so two trains started at 7 am from the same point first train traveled north at a speed of 80 km per hour and second train traveled south at a speed of 100 km per hour time at which they were 540 km apart yeah look at this image so if this is the starting point if this is a starting point common starting point this train a is going this direction train b is going this direction that is a meaning yeah if this is north this is south yeah some of you may be saying north should be this and this should be south that is relative na if i take this is north opposite is south that only matters here for space purpose vertical space i have less that is why i am using horizontal screen so i am considering this as north and this as south don't get offended by that those people who are thinking this should be north direction this should be south direction directions are all relative so i am considering this as north then this should be south you cannot then call this as south because perpendicular nahi hoga north and south that is what you need in this question so anyway train a ye direction mein hai train b ye direction mein hai train a ka speed diya hai 80 km per hour train b ka speed diya hai 100 km per hour in that case 540 they are now 0 km apart because they are in the same starting point 540 km apart kab hoga like i told you in the speed distance time chapter we can practically understand this no need to use formula directly also you can do it formula use kiya to bhi galat nahi hai but directly also you can do it hour by hour socho one hour me kya hoga situation train a train b train a 80 km train b 100 km na because train a ka speed 80 km per hour hai train b ka speed 100 km per hour hai matlab they are 80 plus 100 180 km apart because they are moving in opposite direction they are moving in opposite direction so they will be 180 km apart after one hour did you all understood that वन आवर के बाद का सिचुएशन डिफरेंस विल बी वन एटी किलोमीटर का क्योंकि ये एटी ये हंड्रेड मिला के वन एटी क्योंकि ये एटी दूर गया या हंड्रेड दूर गया ना सो हंड्रेड और एटी टोटल डिस्टेंस इज सम नॉट डिफरेंस सो टू आवर के बाद ये वन एटी डिफरेंस थ्री सिक्सटी डिफरेंस हो जाएगा ना क्योंकि अगेन वन मोर एटी अगेन वन मोर हंड्रेड So, 180 का डिफरेंस अगेन क्रिएट कर रहा है थ्री अवर में क्या होगा अगेन 180, 540, एटी फाइव फोर्टी एंड एक्सैक्टली दैट इज वॉट वी नीड फाइव फोर्टी किलोमीटर के लिए कितना आवर चाहिए थ्री आवर चाहिए कौन सा टाइम से शुरू किया सेवन ए एम से शुरू किया सेवन ए एम प्लस थ्री अवर विल बी द एंसर सेवन ए एम प्लस थ्री अवर विल बी टेन ए एम सो टेन ए एम इज द एंसर सुपर ई सी ना अगेन आई एम नॉट सेंग दैट यू शुड राइट लाइक दिस यू शुड थिंक लाइक दिस सो दैट यू डोंट राइट हाउ टू राइट एनी स्टेप You can just think one hour me one eighty three hour me five forty so three hour answer so seven plus three is ten ten steps na hi chahiye you don't yeah if you mathematically write also it is correct itself you can say relative speed will be eighty plus hundred why plus because they are moving in opposite direction the objective is to go away and away from each other they are supporting that objective. ऐसा सोचना दैट इज वाई टोल्ड यू डोंट मग अप सेम डायरेक्शन माइनस ऑपोजिट डायरेक्शन प्लस डोंट बाई हार्ड लाइक दैट सिचुएशन बेस्ड यू नीड टू एनालाइज सो रिलेटिव स्पीड परस्पेक्टिव में भी बता सकता है 180 किलोमीटर पर आवर 180 किलोमीटर पर आवर कितना डिस्टेंस क्रिएट करना है 540 सो डायरेक्टली फॉर्मूला यूज किया तो भी टाइम इज इक्वल टू डिस्टेंस बाई स्पीड फाइव फोर्टी बाई ऐसा किया तो भी थ्री आवर मिलेगा बट इसके लिए एक स्टेप लिखना पड़ेगा बट यू आर नॉट गेटिंग इन डू द लॉजिक दैट इज वाई एम आस्किंग यू टू थिंक दिस वे आवर बाई आवर वेर आवर पॉसिबल सम क्वेश्चन दैट इज नॉट पॉसिबल देयर यू कैन यूज फॉर्मूला 
Length of train matter nahi karega na Tanushree because train is not trying to cross the other train. As I told, that is why I told you don't buy hard situations. Don't buy hard formula. Previous question mein objective was the train to cross the other train or that six situations I told. But that is not the situation in this question. Na. In this question train should be away from each other. Initially they were 0 km apart. 540 km apart ke liye kitna hour chahiye. That is the question. I hope all of you understood this. Then let's go for. Yeah this is a simple question. 2016 exam this was asked. Super fast try it. 2 minutes will be more than enough. All of you try it. Yeah, we need to discuss fast and discuss uh, bot and streams also. Thank you, Shaishta. Uh, Vijaya, verbal ability we will discuss separately. Now focus on this chapter. Verbal ability also I will be giving 10 classes. That time I will give more tips and tricks and all. Don't worry. Just subscribe the channel and continue attending the class. Yes, all mechanical or any engineering stream gate exam, verbal ability is common itself, Vijaya. All gate streams, aptitude section is entirely common, verbal ho, non-verbal ho. And those who want to be part of the exclusive telegram channel where I post the daily free study materials, homework questions, free videos, daily quizzes. All those you can get from the link tagged in the chat. New students subscribe the channel and click on the live chat feature. There you can see the link. Those who are watching this recorded also that way you can find the link for the exclusive telegram channel. Very good. Some of you already got it. It's a simple question only. Okay, so I'll explain. So the time is up. Luna, the PDF you will get from the Telegram channel tagged in the chat. Be part of the Telegram channel daily after the class, either that day itself or the next day morning, the PDF is uploaded. So it takes 10 seconds and 15 seconds respectively for two trains traveling at different constant speeds to completely pass a telegraph post. So passing the telegraph post is the objective. So this is the telegraph post. The length of the first train is 120 meter. First we will analyze only about the first train 120 meter and that of the second train is 150 meter. Magnitude of the difference in speeds of the train. So speed 1 fine karo, speed 2 fine karo. So, ये train, yes, telegraph post को cover करने के लिए first situation है ना, first situation means train should cover its own length. So, उसे find कर सकता है ना speed, 120 meter cover करना है, कितना time में, respectively means first train का time 10 seconds है. So, 120, 10 seconds में, so 120 by 10, 12 meter per second हो गया first train का speed, speed 1. First train ka speed 10 seconds, sorry 12 seconds ho gaya, clear hai na. You don't have to write this stuff, you can just think. 10 second mein 120 meter, so 1 second mein 12 meter. 1 second mein kitna meter, that is a literal meaning of speed. If it is expressed in meter per second, if it is expressed in kilometer per hour, that way it will change. Is that clear? 
सो स्पीड वन इज ट्वेल्व मीटर पर सेकेंड अभी सेकेंड ट्रेन के बारे में सोचो सेकेंड ट्रेन वन फिफ्टी मीटर दिस इज द सेकेंड ट्रेन यू थिंक अबाउट सेकेंड ट्रेन टेलीग्राफ पोस्ट को कवर करने के लिए टोटल वन फिफ्टी मीटर ट्रेवल करना है ना सो स्पीड टू सेकेंड ट्रेन का स्पीड विल बी वन फिफ्टी बाई टाइम टेकन इज गिवन फिफ्टीन सेकेंड फॉर द सेकेंड ट्रेन सो फिफ्टीन बाई वन फिफ्टी बाई फिफ्टीन टेन मीटर पर सेकेंड इज अकेंड स्पीड अदरवाइज लॉजिकली थिंक करो वन सेकेंड में फिफ्टीन मीटर सो टेन सेकेंड में वन फिफ्टी मीटर ना वन सेकेंड में फिफ्टीन सॉरी फिफ्टीन सेकेंड वन फिफ्टी मीटर इन फिफ्टीन सेकेंड सो वन बाई फिफ्टीन द वन फिफ्टी टेन मीटर पर सेकेंड एनी वे टेन मीटर पर सेकेंड होगा फर्स्ट स्पीड सेकेंड स्पीड फर्स्ट स्पीड ऑलरेडी फाइन किया था ट्वेल्व मीटर पर सेकेंड सेकेंड स्पीड टेन मीटर पर सेकेंड क्वेश्चन इज आस्किंग डिफरेंस इन दीज स्पीड सर ट्वेल्व माइनस टेन इज वॉट यू नीड टू फाइंड ट्वेल्व माइनस टेन इज टू मीटर पर सेकेंड ना वेरी सिंपल ना या डिफरेंट डिफरेंट सीनेरियोज दे कैन गिव बेसिक आइडिया ऑफ स्पीड डिस्टेंस एंड टाइम इफ यू इंप्रोवाइज यू कैन ईजली डू दीज क्वेश्चन then try this question this came in a previous csr exam yeah this i will give us homework otherwise it will take a lot of time we have to discuss bot and streams also ye hai another example try it i have given the solution also train is running like this it should cross entirely like this that's a meaning cross entirely like this and that means unit conversion also just like previous class i told you in case any question demands you to convert meter per second to kilometer per hour 18 by 5 factor se multiply karna hai meter kilometer per hour to meter per second hai to 5 by 18 se last class mein already discuss kiya wo kahan se aaya 18 by 5 and all then try this question 2014 gate exam problem all of you try thank you so much ajmerun for the good words yeah thank you all of you for keeping me motivated that is a big thanks to all of you to be frank there are many challenges in this course running daily due to my health reasons health reasons mainly means uh, my throat is not accommodating because today already 6 hours class is there so only your motivations and your good words is keeping me uh, continue this course so please keep doing it please invite more and more people please um, supporting this course and supporting this free initiative paid initiatives i will not suggest you to support that is up to you whether to join but if it is a free initiative do support that educator because yeah definitely the educator also will be benefited some way or the other but he is doing or he or she is doing something extra so that more people can attend free classes also by that perspective only most of the free educators or free course delivering educators give cl classes that is my belief so do support not only me anyone who is giving free courses uh, continuously and one more thing i want to tell you daily we are posting quizzes and all in the telegram channel it have Uh, i have seen that now the responses from students in the quizzes is not that much so try to answer that questions quizzes and homework questions the homework questions itself our team is preparing us um, quizzes so please try it in the telegram channel daily free quizzes free videos are also added so please make use of those resources also So the time is up. So train that is two eighty meters long, traveling at a uniform speed. Speed कितना है पता नहीं है. Crosses a platform in sixty seconds and passes a man standing on the platform in twenty seconds. So there are actually two situations. Even if it is in the same line, please consider it as two different situation. 
man passing the train is trying to cross the man means that is a situation one case negligible length because the man is not running he is standing there so it is just like the telegraph post being crossed same situation itself so 280 meter long train is trying to cross this man means that train should cross 280 meter na kitna seconds mein wo kar raha hai 20 seconds mein so time bhi pata hai distance bhi pata hai to speed find kar sakta hai na second sentence se second sentence se speed find karo wo first sentence mein substitute karo answer mil gaya just like the first example i showed you there it was direct First sentence itself, first sentence analyze करने के बाद second analyze करना था. लेकिन यहाँ पे second part से शुरू करना है, because that is where, that is where we know clearly length of train and the person's length is negligible. So every information is there. That is why speed is equal to distance 280 by time. 280 by 20. 280 by 20 is 14 meter per second. सबको clear है ये 14 meter per second कहाँ से आया? Please respond. 14 meter per second is the speed of the train. 14 meter per second is the speed of the train. Yeah, then some of you may be thinking how that is possible. The man is standing on the platform. Then why I am not considering the platform in that situation? Because as I told that are two different situation. When the train want to cross this man, train should cross only the man. You don't have to worry about the platform at all. वहाँ पे प्लेटफॉर्म रेलेवेंट नहीं है, ट्रेन क्रॉसिंग द मैन ओनली। दैट इस वाइ दिस ट्रेन लेंथ 280 मीटर वाला ट्रेन 280 मीटर कवर करना है और स्पीड टाइम दिया है 20 सेकेंड्स है। सो उसे फाइन किया हम दैट डिस्टेंस और स्पीड इस इक्वल टू 280 बाय 20 280 बाय 20 14 मीटर पर सेकेंड हो गया। अभी सेकेंड सिचुए crosses the platform in 60 seconds ये 280 meter वाला train train platform का length तो पता नहीं है so record unknown को x assume किया ये 280 meter वाला train ये platform को cross करना है मतलब entire 280 meter train ये entire platform को cross करना है ना so it is the second situation I am I have explained x plus 280 is the distance to be travelled and the time taken is 60 seconds and Speed is equal to, we know that, or we can do other way around also. That is up to you, which you equate. Yeah, I will equate distance. That will be better. Distance equal to speed into time, na? so that the fraction part is directly sorted out. That is how you get, if you have flexibility within distance, speed, time idea, you can directly say, yeah, pe distance equate karna better hai. Kyoki distance pe unknown hai. Ye do no known values hai. Clear distance to be travelled is 280 plus x. Speed of the train only. Platform is still not moving. Speed of the train we found from the previous data. 14 meter per second. Into time taken is not 20. It is 60 seconds. So, this is solve karo answer will gaya. x is equal to 14 into 60. 14 into 60 will be 840. 840 minus 280. 840 minus 280 will be 560. This is one way of doing it. There is another way to improvise this. But did you understand this mother? That is the first thing I want to tell you. Question is asking platform length. Question is not asking total length to be covered. That is 840 but that is not the answer. Answer is 840 minus this 280. Because this 280 length train ka hai. Baki length the platform ka. Is that clear all of you? Another improvisation you can make us to save more time, you can actually do another thing. Listen very carefully. You can do another thing. You don't have to consider the train covering the platform completely. Instead, you can think the distance train, if the train is only not crossing, train is only reaching here. That means the length covered is length covered or the distance covered is the required unknown the platform length in a platform length and yes 60 seconds may 20 seconds train train ka hi length cover karne ke liye use karega na kyoki wo 20 seconds wo ek person ko cross karne ka hai matlab wo 
पर्सन का क्रॉस करना मतलब ट्रेन ट्रेन का ही लेंथ क्रॉस करने का टाइम है वो मतलब वो 60 में से 20 सेकेंड्स ये लेंथ ये ट्रैवलिंग के लिए है सो so, वो डिलीट किया तो वो 20 60 से भी डिलीट करना है सो दैट इज ओनली 40 सेकेंड्स रिमाइनिंग आर यू अंडरस्टैंडिंग दिस सॉरी वी कैन इक्वेट डिस्टेंस इक्वल टू स्पीड इन टू टाइम डिस्टेंस इज एक्स स्पीड वी ऑलरेडी फाउंड 14 14 इन टू टाइम टेकन इज ओनली फोर्टी Directly you can do this. That will save little more time. But due to lack of time, let me tell you now. If you didn't understand the second perspective, leave it for the time sake. Because if we focus on that now, we will not be able to cover the pending topics. First approach clear है तो वो काफी है. But this will save time. That subtraction multiplication will be reduced. Fourteen into forty instead of doing fourteen into sixty minus fourteen into twenty. So, okay, Muskan. So, if that is clear, this is another question. This is an improvisation of the same idea itself. Question is little lengthy. Can you try it yourself? Its a detailed solution diya hai. So, yeah, go through the solution. It is. Uh, it will take some time to explain. That is why I am giving this as homework. Detailed explanation I have prepared for you. Go through it. It is very similar to the previous question, but they have made the question little more lengthy. Little more lengthy. In 2018, it came. A person cross uh, the man crossing object scenario is also there. Man crossing platform scenario is also there. Dono analyze karna hai. 200 or 175 answer milega. Option D. And this is also one more practice question for you to try. This is also a practice question for you to try. Let me see. I will provide the PDF of this also. A solution of this in the PDF. Gate 2020 question. Make a try. The idea we have discussed, we have to use here. But this is a little time-consuming question. Option B will be the correct answer. Try this. So now we will discuss bot and streams. Otherwise, time will not be enough. Train problem का basic idea I hope all of you understood. Bot and stream problem अभी discuss करेगा. Before that can you make a try with this question? Gate exam में bot and stream only one or two time it was asked. So anyway try this super fast. Bot and stream का theory इसके बाद explain करेगा. Okay रहनू.
okay some of you got it let's see whether it is right yeah it was a numeric answer type so answer key was not given so i'll give you some basic idea of bot and stream chapter yeah i think only this question came till now from bot and stream but what i will suggest you is understand speed distance time as a single chapter train problem ho ya bot and stream problem ho idea to speed is equal to distance by time hi hai ya uska logical idea hai तो वो बॉटम स्ट्रीम आया तो भी ट्रेन आया तो भी यू शुड बी एबल टू टैकल व्हाट इज हैपनिंग दैट इज आई एम फोकसिंग ऑन व्हाट इज द कॉन्सेप्ट प्रॉपरली सो इन बॉटम स्ट्रीम इफ यू मग अप द आइडिया सेम डायरेक्शन ऑपोजिट डायरेक्शन यू विल बी कंफ्यूज्ड बिकॉज देयर इज अ डिफरेंस फ्रॉम ट्रेन प्रॉब्लम हियर ऑब्जेक्टिव इज डिफरेंट दैट इज अ प्रॉब्लम और दैट इज द डिफरेंस बॉटम स्ट्रीम हाउ अ बोट इज मूविंग थिंक अबाउट इट इफ देयर इज अ बोट बोट कैन मूव डाउन द स्ट्रीम ऑल्सो अप द स्ट्रीम ऑल्सो है ना वट इज डाउन द स्ट्रीम एंड अप द स्ट्रीम डाउन द स्ट्रीम मीन्स या ग्रेविटी विल सपोर्ट इट दैट मीन्स इट कैन गो फास्ट वाई फास्ट क्योंकि यह बोट का भी एक स्पीड है वॉटर का भी एक स्पीड है स्पीड ऑफ बोट स्पीड ऑफ वॉटर वाटर का स्पीड मीन स्पीड ऑफ रिवर स्पीड ऑफ स्ट्रीम स्पीड ऑफ वाटर स्पीड ऑफ बोट इन सॉरी स्पीड ऑफ वाटर ये सब सेम है व्हेन आई से स्पीड ऑफ वाटर व्हेन आई से स्पीड ऑफ रिवर ऑल दैट आर सेम इट सेल्फ इन क्वेश्चन आल्सो यू कैन सी डिफरेंट टर्मिनोलॉजी समटाइम्स इट विल बी मेंशन स्पीड ऑफ स्ट्रीम समटाइम्स स्पीड ऑफ रिवर समटाइम्स स्पीड ऑफ वाटर ऑल मींस द सेम सो That I am calling speed of water S W speed of water or velocity of water speed of boat. But boat have an external speed, na? Boat have an external speed. There is a motor attached to the boat. वो motor के वजह से एक external speed भी है ना? इसलिए it can go upward also. Otherwise it can not go upward, na? Because the water will push it down. So to go upward, it will it should have a bigger speed than the speed of water that means these are the two situation when the boat is along the stream or down the stream all means the same along the stream along the river down the stream these kinds of terminology you understand properly that means the boat is getting support of the speed of water also support means addition na that is why i told you don't mug up because if you think River speed, boat, boat, and river direction. That is same direction. Here same direction we are adding. Unlike train problems, why that is? Because here the water is pushing it down. Objective is to go down. Water is supporting it. That's why we are adding. But in the train, train to cross, when it comes, what is the situation? Train is trying to cross. When it is same direction, the other train is not supporting. It is going away and away and away. That train is not pushing the train. लेकिन यहां पर वॉटर बोट को पुश कर रहा है इफेक्टिवली आई यू अंडरस्टैंडिंग पुश कर रहा है मतलब इट इज मेकिंग द स्पीड फास्ट मेकिंग द स्पीड फास्ट मीन समीड दैट इज हाउ टू लर्न इट डोंट मग इट अप सेम डायरेक्शन ऑपोजिट डायरेक्शन ऐसा मग अप नहीं करना अंडरस्टैंड बोट नीचे जा रहा है तो बिकॉज अदर सिचुएशन कैन ऑल्सो कम दैट इज आई एम आस्किंग दैट इज आई एम सेंग हाइपोथेटिक हेलो एम आई ऑडिबल ओके देर वॉज अ टेक्निकल ग्लिच इट इज सॉर्टेड नाउ देर वॉज सम आई थिंक इट वॉज एन इंटरनेट इश्यू इट सेल्फ सो वी विल कंटिन्यू ओके नाउ ओके सो लेट्स कंटिन्यू सो मेंशन इन द चैट वेदर द ऑडियो वीडियो इज परफेक्ट यस so uh, i was discussing downstream and upstream two situations of boat and streams so if it is downstream the boat is supported by the water so speed of boat plus speed of water is the effective speed or relative speed but if it is up the stream or against the stream that means the boat speed is relatively reduced by water speed because it is pushing it down na 
just like you can this is analogous to the situation you try to cycle up the bridge and down the bridge cycling up the bridge is easier down the bridge you can uh, you can cycle down faster isn't it same situation itself up the bridge hai to wo uh, gravity is against us down the bridge hai to gravity is supporting us so all clear na itna clear hai na sabko so this is the only idea that you need to do bot and stream problem downstream hai to speed of bot plus speed of water upstream hai to speed of bot minus speed of water so ye question mein ye kaisa useful hoga we will try to discuss man row at 8 km per hour in still water okay row in still water means that is the speed of boat please understand they may not directly give you speed of boat in the question they will say speed in still water because still water matlab only the boat stream is acting na that means it is indirectly saying it is the speed of the boat now finally question is asking finding the find the stream velocity stream velocity means that is the speed of water that is our required unknown x so i will take that as x so speed of boat speed of water i explained earlier i hope it is clear now how that is relevant here if it takes him thrice as long as uh, to row upstream as to row downstream so here actually you can do the variation idea directly to find the answer speed is inversely proportional to time but before that first i will explain uh, properly what is happening so that you get the complete understanding of boat and stream problem in general row upstream rowing upstream we will discuss when he row upstream the speed of boat will sorry speed effective relative speed will be 8 minus x na 8 km speed of boat minus speed of water 8 minus x when he go do, row ra, downstream it will be 8 plus x did you all understood this 8 minus x and 8 plus x but he is rowing the same distance na he is rowing the same distance so i will take let d be the distance upstream and downstream is the same distance itself so what is compared time is being compared so time taken to row upstream time taken to row upstream and time taken to row downstream is actually compared how it is compared thrice as long as upstream matlab upstream time three times will be sorry ha downstream time ka three times it takes thrice thrice as long to row upstream downstream time se bhi three guna hoga upstream time so three times downstream time should be upstream time is that clear or not yeah obviously downstream time chota hoga na wo chota number ko three se multiply kiya to ye bada number time taken to go upstream milega is that clear this equation or this given statement aisa hai to time upstream kya hoga distance by speed hai na upstream speed 8 minus x hai d by 8 minus x hai three times downstream speed d by 8 plus x hai इसको सिंप्लीफाई किया तो आंसर मिलेगा d by 8 plus x ये d d anyway cancels that is why I told you you can take d or if you want you can take an example for d just like we did in work and time chapter work and time chapter and speed distance time chapter is actually more or less the same even if the terminologies are very different so anyway we can say 8 plus x equal to 3 times 8 minus x cross multiplying you will get 24 minus 3x 3 into 8 x into 3 that is 3x and 1x add up 4x equal to 16 4x 16 hai to x4 hoga na x will be 4 km per hour 4 km per hour so stream velocity will be 4 km per hour sabko clear hai ye so that is the idea of boat and stream problem boat and stream only one time directly they have asked in gate exams but if you want more practice questions i will give you these are few part practice question yeah this is so simple question due to lack of time i will start explaining a man can row 15 km per hour downstream and 9 km per hour upstream the speed of the boat in still water if you know directly you can say it is average of the speed but i will explain in detail it's a speed of boat plus speed of water is this speed of boat minus speed of water is this situation so speed of boat plus speed of water is equal to 15 speed of boat minus speed of water is equal to 9 na 
इससे हमें क्या फाइन करना है स्पीड ऑफ बोट इन स्टिल वाटर मीन दिस इज अवर रिक्वर्ड ऑन नोट सो ये फाइन करना है तो ये दोनों ऐड करना काफी है ना स्पीड ऑफ वाटर क्या आंसर हो जाएगा टू टाइम स्पीड ऑफ बोट इज इक्वल टू फिफ्टीन प्लस नाइन दैट्स वाई टोल्ड यू फाइंडिंग द एवरेज इज ऑल्सो इनफ इन दिस क्वेश्चन बट दैट पार्ट वी विल डिस्कस इन द एवरेज चैप्टर सो स्पीड ऑफ बोट इज बोट इज इक्वल टू फिफ्टीन प्लस नाइन ट्वेंटी फोर बाई टू ट्वेल्व बिकॉज ट्वेल्व से थ्री कम थ्री से ज्यादा किया तो फिफ्टीन और नाइन मिलेगा दैट इज अ रीजन एनी वे ट्वेल्व विल बी द एंसर डिड यू ऑल अंडरस्टेड more questions to practice i will give you please try these questions this question is an easy one solution is also given go through it and this is also a little more tricky one which came in a previous csr exam and uh, this are extra practice questions for you to try yeah this one we already discussed now answer for and this also you can try this also you can try this also you can try in the pdf i will add it subscribe the channel and you can download the pdf by being part of the telegram channel associated with this course so hope today's session was useful uh yeah technical issues were there in in between but i hope what i have taught you you understood properly so speed distance time time unit we have completed last class speed distance and time general questions average speed wala concepts today we discuss boat and stream sorry trains problem in train problem in detail and also boat and stream problem basic idea so now different questions these questions you try then you will get more clarity some of them are trickier but try it so in the upcoming class i will try to arrange some classes for that also and today 5 pm those who are preparing for csar net exam i am starting a free series in an academy youtube channel it's a completely free series September 2022 net exam questions. If possible, we will put that in the chat. Uh, if the link is available, can you put in the chat? Team, can you please put the uh, today 5 p.m. class link in the chat so that those people who want to attend it can attend it. Otherwise, in the Telegram channel that will be given uh, before 5 p.m. so that you can enroll for it. Who class? सी एस ए आर नेट अस्पायरेंस के लिए स्पेशली यूजफुल होगा गेट अस्पायरेंस के लिए प्रैक्टिस के लिए वो सेशन यूजफुल होगा सो यू कैन अटेंड एंड अदर फ्री रिसोर्सेस आर ऑल्सो अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ दिस वीडियो एंड टेलीग्राम चैनल बी पार्ट ऑफ इट सो दैट यू कैन गेट डेली फ्री मेटीरियल्स एंड पी डी एफ ऑफ ईच ऑफ द नोट्स आई एम गिविंग एंड पी डी एफ ऑफ द होमवर्क क्वेश्चन ऑल्सो एंड डेली क्विजेस प्लीज ट्राई टू अटेम द डेली क्विजेस वी नीड मोर पार्टिसिपेशन इन द क्विजेस ऑल्सो द टीम इज टेकिंग मोर एफर्ट टू पब्लिश दैट होमवर्क क्वेश्चन पॉल एंड ऑल सो प्लीज रेस्पॉन्ड टू दैट फाइव पी एम बायोटेक की टूडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग सेप्टेंबर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू सी एस सी आर नेट एक्साम क्वेश्चन आर एम सीरीज ये समेत सो इफ यू आर प्रिपेरिंग फॉर सी एस सी आर नेट एक्साम ऑल्सो अटेंड द फाइव पी एम क्लास आई विल सजेस्ट यू इफ यू आर नॉट प्रिपेरिंग सी एस सी आर नेट एक्साम इफ यू स्किप फाइव पी एम क्लास ऑल्सो इट्स ओके बट इफ यू आर प्रिपेरिंग फॉर सी एस सी आर एक्साम ऑल्सो बिकॉज मेनी ऑफ यू आर प्योर स्ट्रीम बैकग्राउंड सो प्योर स्ट्रीम इफ यू आर प्रिपेरिंग फॉर नेट एक्साम यू कैन अटेंड द फाइव पी एम क्लास Eleven o'clock class is dedicated for gate PYQs and gate PYQ theory, previous year questions and practice question. Other courses are there in my profile where CSCR net PYQs, CSCR net uh, complete course, practice course, etc. are are available. So that's it. And after the class, if you felt the session is useful, do share this video to maximum people. At least like this video if you felt the session is useful. That will be a big help for this video to reach to more and more people. All of you should do that if you felt the class is useful. If you haven't felt the class is useful, you can dislike also no problem. But if you felt it was useful, uh, please do let me know. Do YouTube also know because that is how YouTube algorithm works. if a free initiative to be successful students participation and student telling that the course is useful to youtube youtube is telling that through this like button that if you like this video you can like it so that that will help youtube to recognize yeah this is a video to be suggested to more gate aspirants so do that and comment on this video what you felt about the class after each class if you felt if what you felt about the class if you can mention in the comments others will be able to know that this is the session yesterday we have i have shared a short video day before yesterday 
regarding this course that video also you can share to others so that they will be able to attend this course from the beginning the playlist is available and the upcoming lectures as live classes itself so that is it and those of you are watching this class recorded also do let me know what you felt about the class I want to have a connect with you people also if you are watching recording also do let me know what you felt through the like button through the comment section and by subscribing to maximum people. So that is it thank you all of you take care all of you have a good day see you all in the next class and uh, take care.